Shalom from Jaffa Gate, Jerusalem on Yom HaShoah, Holocaust Memorial Day here in Israel. And I uh, was uh, privileged to attend that memorial event at the Memorial Museum at Yad Vashem this morning. And, uh, you know, uh, I was uh, a few weeks ago uh, conducting a video from England, my diaspora home, and now I have returned to Zion as I did with my wife Helen over 13 years ago when we made Aliyah and became citizens of Israel. In Isaiah it says, Therefore the redeemed of the Lord shall return and come with singing unto Zion and everlasting joy shall be upon their heads. Well, it is a joy to be back home in Israel and here I am in Jerusalem, our capital city, on a beautiful day. Israel, with all of its challenges and problems, full and free, beautiful nation with wonderful people. And um, I want to say to all of you that Zion matters to you. Jesus, Yeshua, is, is coming back to this city. And that will be the greatest joy of all when he returns to Zion. But in the meanwhile, for we Jewish people, this is our home. We're happy to share it, but this is our home. And um, don't let anybody fool you that this isn't important. Because some people say we don't have a right to exist. And they're high up in the nations and, and politicians and uh, among our neighbors. They would like to destroy us. But this is God's land. And uh, there is a promise that wonderful promise in his word the redeemed of the Lord shall return I remember before Helen and I moved to Israel attending a meeting in Reading where we heard the late and wonderful um, Lance Lambert ministering the word of God and we sang together therefore the redeemed of the Lord shall return and come with singing and desire as we sang it while I was still in the diaspora of England tears rolled down my face well those tears now are tears of joy because I'm home. I'm back in Zion. God said he would bring us back from the north, the south, the east and the west, and we are back. And I want to ask you, my brothers and sisters, to continue to pray that the Lord would bring the Jewish people back to Israel from the north, south, east and west. And in so doing, he's fulfilling his covenant word and glorifying his name. So Abba, I just pray Lord, that you would bring many more of your people back to Zion and the everlasting joy of knowing who their Messiah is would uh, mean that they would be redeemed and the joy would be visible in the lives and in the hearts of your people. God bless you from Jerusalem today.